Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. So I'm going to a music festival in a couple of days so I thought it would be appropriate just to do a little tutorial inspired by it. So I'm just priming my face first with the Porefessional by Benefit and for my foundation I'm using this Chi Chi Fabulous and Flawless foundation and I'm just dotting that all over my face and then blending it out with a damp Exo Beauty sponge. using this Instant Age Ruin Concealer by Maybelline and I'm just going to pop that under my eyes just to conceal and to highlight and I'm also going to pop it down the center of my face so my chin, my cupid's bow, down the center of my nose and in the middle of my forehead. <laughs> bake all that concealer that I put down now so I'm using the RCMA no color powder and I'm just popping that on just with that same EXO beauty sponge and we're gonna let this sit on our face for a couple of minutes before we brush it off like I am now and I'm just taking any of the excess powder and just brushing it over the rest of my face just to set my foundation going into my Anastasia Beverly Hills palette now I'm just using the shade banana and I'm just popping that on to highlight my face and for contour, I'm using the shade Fawn, which I believe is the middle colour in the palette. And I'm just using that on my favourite contour brush. This one so happens to be the Real Techniques contour brush, I do believe. And I'm just carving out my cheekbones with that. Here I'm just picking up a Morphe M405 brush and just going over that contour again just to make sure it's well blended. And now I'm jumping into the shade Havana from that same contour palette just on a nice fluffy brush just to bronze up my complexion a little bit. For my highlighter I'm going to be using two today. This first one here is Albatross by NARS and I'm just popping that on all the high points of my face. And the second one here that I'm using is Pink Diamonds by e.l.f. and I'm just popping that all over the places that I put the first highlighter to just give like a pinky gold sort of reflect to my highlight. And now for blush, I'm using this, what am I using? I'm using Napoleon blush, I uh, can't remember the shade right now so I'll list it down below for you and I'm just putting that on the apples of my cheeks. For my eyebrows, I'm going to be using Chi Chi Brow Pomade in the shade Black Brown and I'm applying that just with an Anastasia Beverly Hills brush, uh, number 12 I do believe, and I'm just shaping my eyebrows how I like. For the eyes, I'll be using the Violet Boss Pro Palette and I'm just jumping into this first shade called Thanks a Latte and then jumping onto the shade Bestie and just popping that all over in my crease just to make a good transition shade. Next jumping into the shade Are You Kitting Me and just popping that again just under that first transition shade just to make my crease look a little bit deeper. Picking up this beautiful shade called Wine and Dine, I'm just popping that again just in my crease and a little bit on my lid and I'm also just bringing it down under my lower lash line and I'm also trying to wing it out as well. I'm um, just making sure this is super blended so you're going to see a lot of blending for this bit. Here I just switched to a smaller brush just with that same shade on it just so I could really get in under my lower lashes. Picking up this dark brown shade now called Brownie Points, I'm just putting that in my crease and just on the outer V a little bit as well. I just switched back to my Wine and Dine colour just to further blend that out a bit. And just grabbing a big fluffy brush just to make sure it's super blended. For the lid colour, I'm grabbing this shade called Toffee just on a flat eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to pack heaps of that just on that bare part of my lid there. Just switched back to my Wine and Dine colour again just to make sure it was well blended. And I jumped back into that brownie points 
brownie points? Yeah, brownie point shade, just to deepen up my outer V a little bit more. Grabbing this shade called So Jelly, I'm just going to pop that just on the right half of my lower lash line and also going to use it just in like the inner tear duct, just to as my inner corner highlight pretty much. And I'm also going to pop it on my brow bone as well, just to have a pretty little pink brow bone highlight. Just applying a little bit of brow gel here as well, just to make sure my eyebrow hairs stay in place all day long. And also giving my lashes a nice good coat of mascara. I'm using the Estee Lauder Sumptuous Knockout, if that's how you pronounce it. I'm going to use these EXO Beauty the Soulmate lashes. So here's how the eyes look all finished now. I just have to finish off the rest of my face and we're all done. For my lips, I'm first going to line them with a Colourpop lippy pencil in the shade Skimpy. And I'm going to fill my lips in with a Colourpop lippy stick and the shade is called Cookie. And I realised I overlined my lips way too much so I'm just grabbing a little lip brush and just cleaning up those edges. I'm just going to top off my lipstick here just with an Essence lip gloss and it's the shade Glamour to Glow and this smells really good. Just finishing it off with a good spray of Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray to make sure it stays all day long throughout the festival. So this is the finished look here. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did, can you give it a thumbs up? That would really help me out. Alright, thanks so much guys. Bye!